Like one? Mm, you could say that. Why am I so stupid? Take it it wasn't with uh, work, then. Well, it was and it wasn't. I finished at a decent enough hour, but you know what they're like. You pour them their poison all night long and then they buy me drinks. Gotta sound just like them, don't I? <laughs> I need a new job. Can you give me one at your office? Part time, please. No, oh, no, 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 no way, no way. I'm lucky to solve my job as it is. And, uh, it's reality knocking, Liz. No more of this part time stuff. Can't keep bailing you out on the rent. Oh, I might need some help with the rent this month. Where's it this time? New bag, chihuahua, some new shoes. I couldn't help it, they were so pretty. They were calling me. Mm. They were so lonely, they needed a home. That's the same then. What happened? out the other night with Jane. Mm -hmm. We had a few pictures and when I left I saw the bus so I ran. I managed to get on the bus just before the door shut but the door shut on my foot and my shoe fell off. Can I just say this story ends with the bus turning into a no, pumpkin? No I tried to get him to stop. I pressed the bell again and again but he wouldn't stop until the next stop. So I got off and walked in the rain naturally with no <laughs> shoes on. My feet got soggy. And when I got to the bus stop where the shoe was, a bus ran over it. Oh. My. It's not funny. They were my babies. Mm -hmm. Oh. Hug it out. Hug it out. <laughs> Listen, if all goes well today, with the job, I'll help you with the rent. And I'll buy you some new shoes. <gasps> Just don't tell Jen. Liz, Jack, door. Oh. <laughs> what? Um, I was just wondering if you had the time to let the power of Jesus enter your life. Let me see. Mm, not in the next 50, maybe 60 years, no. Oh, um, well, well uh, perhaps you can reorganize your life with the power of the Lord. Really? You people still do this stuff? Have you heard of the internet? Anyone who cares can come cascading down the optical fibre connector things and transcend to a higher dimension through the glorious creations of computers and never even have to leave the house or meet another human being because when they do, boy will they realise there could not possibly really be a god creator because if there was he's gone and fucked up this one, hasn't he? Who let you in anyway? Uh, there was this wonderfully sweet old lady downstairs. I, oh. I helped her with her shopping. She was. You do good as can't get enough of the gloating, can you? How did she know you're not a mugger? In fact, how do I know you're not here casing the joint? Numero eight, good sir. I'm sorry, I really thought you'd have turned around and left by now. Isn't there some other soul you need to save? I, uh, I cannot envision a soul as deeply malformed as thine own. What? Something about me? My gloriously satanic aura? My almost demonic nature? Go on, indulge, sin, give a little, take a bite of the apple. Well, I, I, I hope to come back at a, a more relaxed time, sir. Yeah, maybe. Or perhaps you could not come back at all, you slimy Bible bashing little cunt. Phone! Phone! Is Liz back yet? No, she's still at work. If your water breaks, you're the one mopping it up. Dude, you're right.
Jen, um, how are you? Um, look, uh, uh, it's, I, I need to talk to you. It's really important. Can you just call me back ASAP? I hope you're well. Okay. Yeah. Bye. Bye. Okay. What's up? You got her pregnant, <laughs> you sly dog. Trying to force her to stay with you. No. It's none of those. Seriously? What's on your mind? Well... Yeah, by all means, let's ignore Neil. Hi, babe. Yeah, uh, kind of bad news. Um, what are you doing? I'm typing. It's pretty commonplace nowadays, no? It's loud. I can't concentrate here, you're on the phone. This isn't just your living room. No, and it's not just your soundscape either. Yeah, 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 Jen, Jen, I'm still here, sorry. Sorry, listen, listen. What the fuck? No, 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 no. what the hell? Jen, 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 Christ, can I just get a word in? Come on, I'm trying to concentrate. Jen, stop jabbering. Christ, stop jabbering. What are you doing? Complaining about you. Now shut up a bit and check my blog. Oh, fuck you. No, 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 not you, not, not you, but, but, thanks for, uh, thanks for shutting up. Yeah, thanks for shutting up. What's wrong? Can't help that. Well, I don't see how you're shocked. I mean, turn on the news and... Well, how can I? How can I? <laughs> yes, well, I think, you know, you know... I'm not going to threaten someone at work. I'm not a psycho. <laughs> yes, well, there might be, might be a slight chance you'll be a bit annoyed if I got arrested for beating up a co-worker. One does not defend themselves in that kind of situation. Uh, hello? Great. Fuck you too. Bitches be crazy, no? Really, is that just your your whole insight into everything in a nutshell, is it? I'm here for you, buddy. Yes, you are. Come what May night and fucking day, aren't you? I'm a constant. It's good to have. You're annoying. I mean, what do you possibly contribute to the household? Well, Aside from money, obviously. Um, I'm particularly useful at trivia, and I can fix up a mean cocktail or two. Great, go be a bartender then, eh? Come on. Uh, seems a bit demeaning. Yeah, no no offence to Liz or anything. It's just, well, the wages? Nah, it's not for me. Yes, I forgot you've got your precious little money-spinning blog, haven't you? Yes, yes, I do. I'll try and ignore your condescending tone for a little bit and admit that, yeah, my site be flourishing. Go out and get a real... Job. So easy for you to say. Try being an agoraphobic. I know you can't, can you? Because it's not a habit. I, ca I just can't fucking sit here with you, okay? Fuck. My heart weeps. What have we got? You okay? Yeah? Why? Just making sure. Is Jack at home from work yet? Uh, yeah, he got back about ten minutes ago. Yeah, he's not in a very good mood, though. Shit, did he say anything? Yeah, because he openly engages with me in such a fashion, doesn't he? True. Oh, milk. Finally. Speak of the devil. Neil says you're a foul demon today. Did he know? Yeah. You're home early. Is this part of the good news we can expect? <laughs> um, you know how we're all adults. 
Um, so we're not going to have any sort of like, oh shit, what do we do? Arguments. I'm out of a job. So, yeah, there it's out there. Mm. Truly sucks, Jack, sorry. So, <coughs> why were you having an argument with Jennifer on the phone then? Surprisingly, she's not all sort of happy, chappy about the whole out of work situation, Neil. Of course, she's not self righteous bitch. Liz, but. It's true, I'm sorry, but she's a right lousy bitch. I love you, Jack, but I don't know why you're staying with her. Really, we're just, we're just making it about this now, are we? Surely there's more pressing issues at hand here. Liz, I understand where you're coming from. I really do, but honestly, just can't be dealing with that right now, okay? Get what? Is there some ulterior motive I'm not picking up on? Oh Christ, is that what this is about? Not everything revolves around you, you know. Neil, I've got to pick up the mail. Again. <laughs>